Okay, we are at the library, the new library of uh, Riel University. We will uh, take a tour outside and then go inside and speak about the elements of the interior design. Okay, we are at the main uh, entrance of the library. Um, there is a square here that uh, been used as a kind of main road for the students that go from the from the university itself to the dormitories and outside to the parking lots. Um, this place has been used as a place to ga for gathering for big gatherings. There were the walls once a concert here. The, this facade is, uh, use, uses a combination of uh, materials and uh, different shapes and kind of uh, claddings. There is uh, the brick cladding over here, the metal cladding, the aluminium cladding, it's, I think, um, over there. And use as well um, the combination of the, the cladding and the curtain wall in the different shapes and angles. Um, it's to make a, combina a uh, composition a different composition that makes, uh, makes it pop more. This is the secondary square beneath the library. It's uh, a one uh, level lower. It's in the level of the dormitories. Um, this big square is opened uh, to the dormitory. Um, at the first floor here, uh, we have the synagogue of the University. Um, here, uh, all the Jewish religious uh, guys and girls are praying. Um, this square here is used uh, mostly in Saturdays um, as a place of gathering after the prayer itself. This is the central hall of the library. This is a double space that opens up to the second floor over there. Um, from the second floor, you have a view to the windows that uh, are over there. Um, this place gives you a very, the feeling of a spacious place, a very uh, non-intimate place. Um, it's not a good thing for a library, but in the other areas, it's different. We'll see that. This is one of the more intimate places for the student to study. Uh, it opens up to the main square um, through the glass curtain wall. Um, it can be a good thing and can be a bad thing because it can be a distraction for the, stu for the students in the study. Uh, and another problem is that, uh, the biggest problem is that the design of the library, the exterior design is entirely disconnected from the interior design and you can see it in the bookshelves. They're placed randomly in the interior and are not speaking to the design of the exterior. Okay, we are at the balcony, uh, at the third floor of the library. This uh, place is uh, being used mostly for the students to take breaks from the studies, um, smoke some cigarettes, speak with their friends, maybe eat lunch. The balcony opens up to the west. Here you have a very good view of the Samaria Mountains and uh, to the direction of the sea where the, most of the cities there are. Um, this can be a very good thing, because it's a very relaxing place to be in, but uh, in the middle of the day, it's very sunny here. Um, in the, near the sunset, you have a very great sunset view, but the sun is very, you have a very bright glare from the sun. Um, overall, this space is a very good, place to relax in. They place the sofas here and the summer umbrellas to shed from the sun. Um, and this is the, the end of the tour.